Hey guys, Seal here. Welcome back to another episode of Skyrim. So, you might see Minx is a little bit angry. Yeah. So, we're going to be doing the mod Falskar on this character. And... Wow. When I returned to, to Skyrim after defeating Mirak, pretty much saving the world, the Riften Guards did not greet me as planned. They are actually very angry with me and... Uh, there's, there's, I have a bounty that I can apparently not remove, there's, there's no way of removing it, it's not going away, so. I've actually had to make it so no one can attack me, so. Shh. But, um, I will turn it back on soon. Okay, we just need to go into Riften to talk to the guy who, to start Falskar, so. That's the main reason I had to do this. But you think, after defeating Mirak, I'd at least get a medal. I mean, come on. What is this? It's not funny, it's unfair to be honest. But I am looking forward to starting this. I've heard very good reviews about Falskar. Um, it's apparently very, very good, so... It took a year to make, so I'm not really surprised. Um, I am looking forward to it. Fine! If you won't listen to me, I'll find someone hey. who will! Somebody, help! I uh, this is the guy we have to talk to. Dude. It's okay. No one's going to hurt you. Look, I'll help you. Stop running. There we go. Huh? Yeah? Are you all right? Huh? Uh, well, not really. What's wrong? Well, I was taking an evening walk like I always do, and I saw some men outside the Echo Deep Mine. The thing is, they look like mercenaries, up to no good. What makes you say that? I've never seen them around here, and they look real tough. In addition, the Echo Deep Mines are not a place people go. There are myths about it. What kind of myths? All sorts of stories. Some say it's haunted by ghosts. Some say a wealthy bandit lord hides out in it, quietly contributing to the crime in Riften. Some people even say that deep within the mines there are Dwemer ruins, full of all sorts of automatons just waiting to slay whoever enters. So what's the problem? On my way back from my walk, I passed mine entrance again. I heard all sorts of horrific noises. I reckon something happened to those men. Anyone going to those mines is up to no good. Now I've asked a guard to take a look, but they just ignore me. I need someone to see what's happened. Would you go look for me? Please, if they're Obviously. planning something, the city guard needs to know. Please, go check for me. Sure. I'll take a look. Finally! Thank you! I'll mark it down on your map. J just be careful. Uh, we still don't know what's in there. Okay. I'm getting out of here. Wow. Where is this mine? Let's see. Ah, it's just up the road. Okay. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? And this should be the right way out to get to that. This should be interesting. So if I am right, this is a new mine they've just completely added into the game, so... I am looking forward to go see this mine. Also, I don't seem to have a follower or a horse. Looks like we're going in this alone, guys. We better start the journey running. Ah, there's my horse. Hello, horse. And there's Kerry. What? What? Yeah. Now that's more like it. Okay. Kerry, what's going on? Because she doesn't seem to be following me. I can't talk to Kerry. Okay. That could be a slight problem. But anyway, we need to head up here. 
Okay. Now we're down here, guys. We are just outside the mine. I didn't mention this earlier. I've got rid of a bunch of mods. Kerry doesn't seem to be following me. She's off to fight the Riften guards. And I'm just going to keep running. She'll meet us in the cave. So I removed a bunch of mods uh, just so this would run a lot smoother and we've got a bear fight. Come on in. Come on. Come on. I ain't afraid of no bear. Ah. Tremble before me. Jesus Christ! Okay, that didn't work. This is not going good. Stop! You'll see me burn, but you're, you're freezing me. Come on. Don't you dare try and freeze me. Take this! Oh yeah. Also, uh, I removed a bunch of re uh, of a bunch of mods that could affect performance, and that uh, included a bunch of the retextures. So as you can see, my sky forge uh, steel sword—it's just gone back to the normal one. But anyway, we entered the Echo Deep Mine. No. Okay, maybe. Jeez. Come on, just... Fulfill your destiny of dying. Okay, I don't really want to go in here alone without Kerry, because I actually don't know what to expect, so... I better get her back. Come carry. Let's go explore. Gold ore, iron ore. Why not? Pretty nice stuff already, I will admit. Carry, please don't go to fight the Rift and Guards again. Oh god. Here we go. Over here. Okay, there's no one in there, so this is all looking good. There we go. Oh. Oh. Oh, chest. Very nice. Uh, I don't have the luxury of having, like, loads of room in my bags. Oh, God, here they are. Straight from behind. Don't you try and attack my carry. Come on, get up. That's actually a very nice... Sea dog armor. Must be part of the mod, but wow, that's. I'm going to take that. That could just be some walking around clothes. Mm, very nice. Oi! What do you not understand about leaving Carrier Lamp? Please. Oh. There's a lot of marauders, isn't there? Oh, straight in the back. We haven't been in Skyrim long and we're already slaughtering everybody. Ooh, have any arrows? Nordic short. Oh, I'll take that. Okay. It's looking clear. I'm getting wet though, which is not the best thing in the world. What's this? Yeah, iron. Yeah, iron's not the best thing in the world to have. Okay, let's keep going. Whoa! Jesus! Talk about a jump scare right there. Just come round the corner, shooting a crossbow at me. Okay. 
There we go. She shot that. There we go. Your crossbow is no match for me. Die. Oh! What you get for cowering? What have we got? Oh, coins. Potion. A burned book. That's brilliant. A chest. Back to this old lockpicking game. Come on. Come on. Yes. First time. The future is looking bright, people. Okay. I was going to do something. Um, never mind. Completely forgot. It was something important, so. So it will come back. But I'm worried. Huh? Now I know why. What was that? And I'm. Oh. Hello. Ah, oh, yes, I was gonna re enchant my weapon, that was it. There you are, Terry. You you distract them while I do that. Okay, let's go. Charge. Let's give it a grand soldier, and there we go. Hello? Paralyze. Paralyze. Your whip. Come on. Oh, that crossbow is vicious. I do not want to get hit by it. I'm like trying my best to just avoid. Oh, God. Straight in. Oh, push one off the edge. No match for me. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get off the edge. Get off. That's one way to do it. Oh, silver. Okay, now that is something that's interesting. See, now I understand why they came down here. Don't you run from me. Did Kerry jump down with them? I've got the slightest feeling she did. John Bus, grant me the strength to do your will. You know what's going on through here? Let me guess, the bandit chief. Oh crap. Ah, coming in. Yeah. This bandit chief's going down. Looks like he's not enjoying paralyzing poison so much. Come on, get up! Get up! Face my sword! There we go. Ebony boots. Ebony shield! I wanted one. I mean, don't get me wrong. This shield. It's nice, but look at that, a hundred and free armor. I mean, yeah, mine. Boom. Let's go. Just need to favor that as well. Okay, let's put that. Let's put the ebony shield free. Do your will. Look how much better that is. I mean, I know it's smaller, but it... it it was the Yzgrimor one. It's really big, and to be honest, I don't like running around with it. Oh, water cleaving. Satchel. Potion of health. Okay. Well, carry. Everything's looking good so far. Ebony boots. Don't really need those. I don't really want to take anything else from there. But I did see quite a lot of stuff to mine, and I mean, how much room do I have? I don't, uh, I don't have the most amount of room in the world. That's the problem. Heavy. That's not as good as mine. So what I'm thinking is, after I adventure, I might come back here and mine everything. 
It's just, I don't think I'm going to have the room. Because I'm not 100% sure if they have fenders in this place. What we got? Very nice. Sapphire. Boom. Let's go. Let's continue our journey. Looks like a Dwemer ruin. Misbefund. Misbefand. I'm going to say I'm pronouncing that right, but it's most likely not the case. Oh god. Well, it seems clear we haven't run into any problems yet, so. All good. Potato plant. It's a bit random, isn't it? Oh, thanks. Thank you. Nord tailoring. Oh, there we go. Potion. Oh, potion. Scroll familiar wolf. Oh. That's pretty cool. Okay, what's through here? I think Kerry's with us. Holy! Last thing I saw coming. Okay. Yeah, we're on our own. I'm not afraid. Okay, I just got knocked out. Oh god, he's hitting me. He's hitting me hard. Whoa! God, there she is. Always showing up late. Get back. Don't want to go near it in case he just one... Whoa! One shots me. <laughs> it hurts. It's scary. Yeah, let's get some healing done. That should keep me up during the beating phase. Don't beat my woman! Who do you think you are? You stupid machine! Gary, the machines are rising up against us once again. Oh, Deirdre Carrows, thanks. Very nice. That hurt. That was not fun. <laughs> that one shot just boom knocking you back really does. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna take it that he just obliterated these guys. Steel. I don't want a tomato. Mercenary leader. Find the men Zhao Ma saw enter the Echo Deep Mine. Figure out what the Lexian does. Okay, let's look at his journal. Always the best place to start. Okay, so books. It was Mercenary Journal, right? Yep. Okay. After far too long searching, we have finally found it. We have found the ancient Lexion and made now travel uh, through the gate. Gate? Perhaps it was luck. Perhaps it was fate. My family's work is no longer wasted and I can fulfill my grandfather's wishes. We are heading to the old buried ruins of Mzbafand. Yeah, tomorrow. I have worked to deal out with the local bandit leader to grant us passage through. We must still watch our backs as they are not to be trusted. We found the gate. It was just as um it was just where the book said it would be. We are going to search the area and examine it real fast, then attempt to use the cube. It appears to have control a manifold we can use. There is a large dwarven centurion here that looks intact, but it's either slumbering or dead as it has yet to be any blah, blah, blah. Scouting tapped it jokingly with his sword and we're confident that it will not harm us. Well, that's not the case, I'm afraid. It kind of killed you. I just hope this thing works. You don't want it to work, trust me. Well, looks like this is where the adventure begins. Okay, 
Okay. What? Carry. Fine, I'll go on my own. It's a portal to another dimension. It's gotta be. This is insane. I will admit, this reminds me of the Harry Potter films. You gotta get your car and then you gotta run through the wall. Arrgh! Alexander J. Thalicky presents. I probably pronounced that wrong. Oscar. Bravo already, that was awesome. That was an awesome intro. Just, wow. I like how he put that in, that is awesome. Oh. What the oblivion? You there? Did you just come through that portal? Yes, I did. Hello. I could use a nap. If you just came through that, then, then that would make you the traveler, wouldn't it? Traveler? What's the traveler? They who arrive through the shimmering gate mark the start of the worst. It's a, just a story, of course. Okay. I'm going to assume you're from Skyrim, and you somehow managed to get the portal working. My job would dictate that I arrest you right here and now. However, I'm in the middle of something important right now. If you give me a hand with it, afterwards you're free to go. Okay, sounds like a deal. I'm searching for a Nord named Machias. He's the blacksmithing apprentice in the nearby town of Ember Creek. Okay. I assume that since he isn't in here, he's in the nearby cave. Unfortunately, I can also assume that that cave is full of bandits. I'll still have to report your arrival to my superiors, but if you assist me, I'll say you were cooperative and helpful. Oh, also, the switch to lower these bars is out here, and it looks like you're portal thing has shut off, meaning I'm the only one who can let you out. Okay. Okay, sounds fair. Alright. Let me lower these bars for you. Okay, Kerry did not follow me through. Now let's get moving. I don't want to waste any more time. Let's just get this over with. Blackmailing me into this. God. Who does this guy think he is? Hey, Carrie. We're on a different dimension. Don't you dare go back. Come on. Come on this way, Carrie. She's hopeless. We're just going to have to go about her, I think. Don't worry about her anymore. I can handle myself. Plus, I've got all here. Okay, what have we got up here? Soul gem. Oh, it's waiting for me. That's nice. Come on. And behold. I'm really enjoying this mod already. This looks like it is going to be very fun. This place is beautiful, I will admit. Don Bliss, grant me the strength to do your will. Oopsie. Oh, okay, apparently I have to go back in. I don't I don't think he went out. Bliss, I think I was supposed to let him to go out will. first. Did I ruin the mood for you? There we go. Good job. Come on then, let's go. This place seems really nice though, I will admit. 
And I'm guessing that's the bandit cave. Are you sure this is a good idea? And that looks like custom gear as well. But obviously it's the guard gear, but it's got um, a custom texture. Very nice.